I'm Miss Alyssa. <gasps> Hi. I'm Miss Alyssa. I'll be your teacher today. What's their name? Ah, oh, that's such a lovely name. We don't have anybody in this class that has that name. Mm-hmm. Okay, so before we start, before we can get to this little cutie into our classroom, we just need you to fill out a few things on this sheet that we give everybody. Now it's a daily report, so what we do is we want to know what your child is into, what they're interested in, um, their last time they were fed, uh, anything that we need to know that we can better this little cutie's day. Okay. Okay, I'm just gonna write it down. So your child's name, please spell that for me. Okay, okay. Yep. And including the last name. Yes. Um, we need, uh, their age. Thank you. And let's see. Can you give me the phone number that we can contact for the day, just in case of anything that we need to discuss on the phone? Beautiful. Okay, let's see. Now, is there any special treatment, uh, maybe to comfort your child whenever they're sad? Um, maybe even to, I don't know, um, just to keep them, um, Feeling like they're at home. Is there anything they like? Any toys? Okay. Yep. Mm hmm. Oh, we have those here. We can definitely do that. Any specific kind? Yep, we have all of those. We just want to make sure that your child is. And their last feeding time, and what did they eat? Ooh, that sounds good. Okay, and their time. Beautiful. Okay, I'm trying to think about anything else. Um, we need three emergency contact. Um, we know you gave us the forms, but we'd like to add them on these reports just so that they're right there so we can get them. But we just need three emergency contacts to help take care of your child in the case of any emergencies. Okay, so the first one. So I need their, so you gave me their name and their, I need their number. Beautiful. And I need their address as well. Is that with an E? Sounds good. And the second one, the name. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, number and address, please. Okay, and can I have the last name, number, and address? Beautiful. Now, we like to tell the parents what they are going to be doing today, and we like to tell you too, so you know that you're going to have so much fun, and that you feel safe and happy here. Here at Tingles Care, we like to help the kids feel at home, so first what we do is we show them around the classroom. As you can tell, behind me, we have so many toys. Um, we clean them and disinfect them all the time. They're over here, and we have some over there. We do circle time, which means we sit on a mat, and what we do is we sing songs, we learn to make our brains nice and strong, and we also like to have the kids teach us something, or maybe even do show and tell, which means if you have a special toy, what we can do is you guys, you guys can bring it to the daycare, and you guys can show it and all the kids can see what you have at home. So we do those on Fridays, so if you want your child to bring it on Friday, they absolutely can. Um, and we do, do snack time, and we do lunch time, so if you have lunch, we eat it. We eat it around 11 o'clock, 
and snack. You can have snack too, which is right after nap time. And what we do is nap time, we have little mats and you can bring a blanket and pillow, which I saw you brought today, and a stuffy. What stuffy do you have? I used to have one of those too. That is so, so cool. So they can lay with their stuffy and they just nap for about an hour or two. And I mean, if they can't sleep that long, it's perfectly fine. We usually sit them at the table with us to do a little puzzle. But it's okay if you don't want to nap right away. It is okay. But we're going to try to help you nap today. Okay. So, what we do is we end up doing um, nap time and they have a snack. And then you guys play until mommy and daddy come home. Well, come here, but not come home. Take you home. <laughs> Sounds good. Yeah, you can give your child a hug and we'll make sure we'll take the good care and if you have any questions be sure to call us and we definitely will give you a heads up and um update you and your child all right say bye bye it's okay it's okay hey 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 it's okay it's okay look miss Al Alyssa is gonna have so much fun with you today we're gonna be really good friends and we're gonna play and we're gonna read and we're gonna eat and we're gonna nap it's gonna be so much fun i promise you and they'll come back mommy and daddy will come back let's see let's try with some some toys okay you wanna play with some toys you want your binky um i don't know if your mom packed in your bag. Let me see. Oh. Mommy didn't pack your binky in your bag, but she did put down on the paper that you do use binkies. Oh, no. We do have brand new binkies that haven't been used before that we put in a bag. We got that. We have four pinkies. You can choose. None of them have been used. This one, which has a little fox on it, it came off as soon as we took it out, but it is new. We have another one with a moon and a heart on it, and we have I Ride Big Waves. It's got a huge whale on it. Do you want this one? No, you want the moon one? Get that too. Okay. Let's see. Here you come. Okay. Here's your pinky. There you go. Is that better? Okay. So right now we're gonna go to circle time learn okay so let's go on the map okay i need everybody sitting sit it is circle time let's sing some songs sit good job my friends okay we need to be very very quiet use our listening ears okay okay shh, 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 shh. put on your your listening ears make sure they're nice and tight Good job. Today, guys, we have a brand new friend. Can everybody say hello? Good job. Okay, so our friend here 
is a little nervous. It's their first day. So we need to be very, very good. And they're also very young, so we need to take good care of them, okay? Okay. So, let's sing some songs. Alright. Let's see. What song shall we sing? Let's learn the months, okay? What month are we in? Good job. We are in August already. Isn't that crazy? So there are 12 months. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 months. And what are they? January, February, March. April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, December. Those are the months of the year. Beautiful job. And what week? Uh, what day of the week are we? Yes, we are Monday. Great job. And there are seven days in a week. Put up a high five and a peace sign. Or scissors. Whatever you want to call it. Or bunny ears. Beautiful job, my friends. You're doing awesome. Okay, let's sing the song. There are seven days, there are seven days, there are seven days in a week. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Beautiful job. Okay, and what day of the week are we on again? Monday. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. Alright, my friends, now. What else? Okay. The next question I have for you guys is, what season are we in? Oh, that's right. We're in summer. Summer, summer, summer. Okay, and there are four seasons. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Four seasons, and they are summer, fall, winter, spring. Let's count the seasons as we sing. Flowers swimming, pumpkin snow makes the seasons we all know. Every year they are the same and we give them each a name. Summer, fall, winter, spring. Count the seasons as we sing. Now I'm going to ask for a boy and a girl to go check the weather out the window. Who would like to check? Easy, easy. Just raise your hand. Okay, Kyle and... Tabitha, go check the weather. What's the weather? What's the weather? What's the weather out today? Is it sunny? Is it rainy? Is it cloudy out today? What's the weather? is cloudy. Did it rain today? No, not today. It's just cloudy. Cloudy and probably warm because it's summer, right? Summer is very hot. Okay, great job, my friends. Alright, so when we put it all together, it goes like this. Today is Monday. It is August 2nd Third, August 3rd. The year is 2020. The season is summer and it is cloudy outside. Do you guys want to do the open shut them song? Beautiful, okay. Open shut them, open shut them, give a little clap. Open shut them, open shut them, place them in your lap and they stay there. Creep them, crawl them, creep them, crawl them, right up to your chin. Open up your little mouth, but do not let them in. Open, shut them, open, shut them, till your shoulders fly. They like little birdies and they fly up to the sky. Fallen, 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 almost to the ground. Quickly pick them up and then you turn them round and round. Faster, faster, slower, slower, stop. Beautiful. Alright, my friends, now I have a little surprise for you guys, okay? Here is my handy-dandy glove. And my glove is made out of a very...
soft fabric, but the only thing that can stick to this is something called Velcro. Now let's see, does any of my friends? Yes, some of our friends have Velcro shoes, which means there's no laces. You don't have to tie. You just put on the strap because it sticks. And I have a glove that holds onto Velcro puppets. And my friends, we are gonna sing a little song called The Itsy Bitsy Spider. Do you guys know that song? I love that song. Here are our little puppets. And as you can see, Velcro. Here how scratchy it is. Okie dokie. Okay. So, we have right here, it is rain. Right? Do you guys like when it rains? What happens when it rains? Things get wet, absolutely. And then we have a beautiful big sun. I love when it's sunny because then Miss Alyssa can go to the beach. She can play outside. She can water her plants. Okay. Then we got a faucet, but in the song they call it a water spout. And when you have a sink, when mommy does dishes or daddy does dishes or you wash your hands, this is the sink and the water is coming out and last we have a spider this is the itsy bitsy spider okay now miss Alyssa is putting up her hand and she's gonna hold it up okay and we're gonna sing the itsy bitsy spider went up the water spout Down came the rain and washed the spider out. Out came the sun and dried up all the rain. And the itsy bitsy spider went up the spout again. Okay. Alright, we're going to do it one more time. Very look closely. The Itsy bitsy spider went up the water spout. <laughs> Down came the rain and washed the spider out. <gasps> up came the sun and dried up all the rain. And the itsy bitsy spider went up the spout again. Isn't that so much fun, my friends? See, it's Velcro, so it's very sticky in the glove. That was fun, my friends. Let's put these back, right? We put our toys back and we're done playing with them. Okay, my friends, circle time is done. In a few minutes, we're, we're gonna have lunch. So, everybody stays, um, stay playing, and we're gonna keep continuing to learn. <laughs> I know you're probably not used to all these friends right now, but it's okay. You're gonna take your time. We're gonna have fun today. Want me to show you some toys that we have? Okay. So, we have this one. This is from a book. Have you read this book before? The Very Hungry Caterpillar. No. We can read that sometime. We don't we're not gonna read it today, but we'll read it sometime. See how crunchy he sounds? And his little legs. He has one, two, three, four, five, six. Six legs. 
how many likes do you have? <gasps> two, me too. I thought you had six. These eyes. Right there. And it hangs. Very, very cool toy. Very fun to play with. Some food. We have a strawberry. Strawberry. And a star. We have a little star. Okay. So I'll put this next to you. If you want to play with it, you can play with it. Let's see. We have this. Right here is a good toy just in case you need if your your teeth hurt do your gums hurt sometimes you probably don't understand what I'm saying but it's okay if you need to put this in your mouth you can we have this it's nice and scratchy what animal is this do you know what animal this is and what does a lion say? Whoa! It does say raw. You scared me. It's super cute. Look at the little whiskers. And the nose. And the smile. And he looks like he's sleeping, right? I'll give this to you too to play with. What's this toy? Oh, look how thin it is. noise like the caterpillar we just played with. And you can put these in your mouth too. Green foot and an orange foot. You can play with this too, but right next to you. And we have this very squishy book. Do you know what animal this is? No? It's okay. We're going to learn about all about animals and what animals there are. This is an owl. And it goes hoo hoo. This book is called Peekaboo Forest. Have you ever played Peekaboo before? You close your eyes and go Peekaboo. Yeah. Okay. So let's let's read it together. Okay. Let's see what this book's about. Who is hiding behind the spruce? Put down the tree. <gasps> Peekaboo. It's the Who is always on the prowl? <gasps> Peekaboo, it's the owl. Beautiful job. Okay. Who is sleeping down there? Peekaboo, it's the bear. Looks like we got a mommy bear. Eats acorns over the moon. <gasps> Peekaboo, it's the raccoon. 
Who built this dam? What an achiever. Peekaboo. It's the beaver. The end. It's a very fun book to read and play with. Do you want to play with it? Okay. They go put right next to you. All right. Now we have these. These are really cool. You can stack them and I'll stack them. There's a hole. And then see these holes? Just put them together. Very fun toy. You saw the bus? Yeah. That when you get older and you go to another school, you'll be on a bus, a school bus. Or someone will take you to school. Miss Alyssa used to be on the bus. But now she's all done with school. And she teaches you. Like this. Next we have this. This is a triangle. Three sides. One, two, three. It's very fun to squish. Now, Miss Alyssa tells her little students, her little tingly, tingly care students, that it is important that if you're sad or you are mad, you can use stuff like this that are very very squishy that you can squeeze if you're angry just squeeze it and release any anger you have just release it it's okay to be sad it's okay to be upset miss Alyssa gets sad sometimes and she gets upset but we gotta find ways to get rid of that right so just squeezing this you to use today if you feel nervous or you feel scared right you can use that the next one we have is this it's a little star it's got these and then this right isn't this so cute <gasps> the janitor What's a janitor? He comes in, and if it's very, very messy, if the floor's all sticky, and we have trash, and the toilets are messy, he cleans it for us. It's so nice, right? Okay, next toy we have is this. It's got a very bumpy feeling. This does make noise. this this is to help you with your teeth so if it hurts in your mouth you can use this to play with it plays music it's got little rings so if you want to play with this you absolutely can we have two more toys that are our faves with this ball so squishy. Make such great noises, huh? And I love how we can squeeze it. I love squeezing. What we have are these little keys. You can pretend you're driving. These are also for your teeth. So if you 
you your mouth hurts you can use these but miss Alyssa is gonna clean these first before because she's been touching them and we don't want you getting sick So you can pretend you're going to the car and you turn it and you're like vroom, 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 right? All of the friends here love to play with this. They love to pretend they're on the car. cleaning up my friends that was the fastest you ever cleaned up good job okay so you guys can take out your lunch boxes and you can eat miss Alyssa put all your lunches in there and she had your snacks so you guys weren't tempted to have your snacks and I know that your mommy said that you're still having a hard time eating so I'm gonna help you eat okay I'm gonna feed you so you can eat what did mommy bring for a little lunch let's see so you have this. Mommy says you can't really eat it. Oh, it's got some fruit that's very, very good for you. Okay, I'm gonna open it up for you. Okay. 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 Say ah. Good job. Very good. Your mommy packed you a bib. Coolest baby ever. Coolest baby ever. Okay, let's hook this to you. There you go. So now you don't make a mess with your food. When you're doing your food, you can go throw it in the trash. Good job. Now it looks like you have a sandwich. So after Miss Alyssa feeds you this, you can eat your sandwich. Because I know you know how to do those handheld foods. But spoons are a little tricky. So good. Open up. eating my friends you having fun today I know it's scary at first but we're having so much fun and you're learning so much your brain is having so much fun mm -hmm. and Miss Alyssa is always here for you so if you get scared or nervous I'm right here okay you can talk to me Timothy, we're not playing with our food. We need to eat it, okay? We need to get nice and strong for mommy and daddy, okay? Mommy and daddy made you that lunch. Then eat it, okay? Thank you. There you go. Yes, Tabitha. If you don't like it, you don't have to eat it. Try to have two bites just to go one, two. Just two bites, and then you could throw it out. One, good job. Take it slow, don't rush it. Two, great job. You can throw it out. I'll let mommy know. Okay, right, let's do something. Here comes the plane. Here comes the plane, Drew. Okay. through the tunnel. Ooh. Great job. 
You only have one more bite, and then you can have your sandwich. job my friends okay yep you can absolutely clean up okay all right great job yeah it's just the janitor again it's okay he's cleaning up right he cleans up all the messes that we make he's a good guy right guys good job all right it looks like everybody is just about done with their food Make sure you guys throw it in the trash, and we're gonna sit down, and we're gonna do a puzzle, and we're gonna read, and then it's nap time. Okay, and your mom says she's gonna pick you up right after nap, so that'll be great. Okay, as soon as you get up, mommy's gonna be here. Okay. All right, my friends, throw out your food. Let's go sit down. Come on circle. Ready? Alright, my friends. Okay. We need to go to sleep. No, nope. In a little bit. But we're going to do a puzzle first. Miss Alyssa has this puzzle. And it has four, four animals. One, two, three, Now, what is this animal? It's so big. A cow. What does a cow say? Moo. Great job. And our last little furry friend. A pig. And a pig goes. Wink, wink, wink. This puzzle's missing pieces. I am gonna ask each of you, four of my friends, to come up and put the right puzzle piece on here. Okay. Daniel, come here. What was this again? It does go Bob, but what's the animal? What's it called? Great job, Daniel. Put the sheep right in the right place. Okay. Would you like to do one? Okay. Here, what animal is this? A pig. Great. What does a piggy say? Oink, oink. Great job. Here you go. Give you the piece and put it where you think it goes. Great job. Is where the piggy goes, isn't it so soft? Alright, Carissa, come here. I'm gonna give you this big animal. What's this animal called? <laughs> A moo cow. You mixed up the the sound and what the animal is, but it's just a cow. Yep, and it does say moo, so here. Great job, that's a big piece, huh? Great job, my friends. Now, Stephen, come here. What animal is this? It is a duck. And what does it say? It does say quack. Okay, so here's this piece. All right, now put it on the board. Right here. Almost didn't take it from my hand. <laughs> put it on the board. friends. You guys put all the pieces right on the puzzle. I'm 
so proud of you guys today. Okay, so before we take a nap, we like to read stories to our little friends. So, today we are reading Snuggle Up, Sleepy Ones, which is what you guys are going to be doing, right? We'll play some, um, some lullabies. You guys can go to sleep. The sun paints the sky a warm glowing red. It's time to stop playing. It's time for bed. In the soft swampy mud, baby hippo so snug cuddles up so close for a big hippo hug. Through wild waving grass, shy antelope roam. These are antelope. They're cute, huh? Bold leopard cubs rest from practicing roars. They snuggle together, all tired, tangled paws. While up in the treetops, birds twitter and cheep. Until quieter and quieter, they fall fast asleep. Below in their nests, the baby porcupines all curl up snug and tight in one spiky ball. See, these are their spikes. They're very, very, very spiky. Pointy. With tired, drooping necks, giraffes flop to the ground, sheltered and watched over, safe and sound. And mischievous monkeys shut down from the trees. It's not really dark yet. Five more minutes, please. Zebras lie, panting, tired out from their play. They sink into sleep as the sun slips away. Moths go fluttering, go by fluttering. Bats flutter by. Elephants rumble their deep lullaby. Shadows grow deeper. The lion cubs doze. Drowsy heads nod. Little eyes start to close. Stars twinkle brightly. The moon softly gleams. Snuggle up, sleepy ones. Hush now, sweet dreams. And here's all the bugs that light up. They're called fireflies. They are. All right, my sleepy tingly friends. It's time to go to sleep, okay? So your mat's already laid out and your blankets and pillows are already on there. And it's time to go to sleep. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Miss Liz is going to help you go to sleep, okay? Okay. Just lay down with your blanket. Lay down. Lay down. Lay down. It's okay. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. Go to sleep, my tingly friend. Go to sleep. 